What's up guys, I'm Sam. I've been loving Squad Busters. I hope you guys have too. I want to talk to you today of the three best ways to use your coins in this game. So here we are in the shop and what I want you to do is completely disregard the shop. It is not the best way to use your coins. So let's talk about it though. What are the three best ways to use your coins? Number one, you want to keep your win streak. So I keep a win streak in Squad Busters. The reason why is whenever you open up a chest, you get to have three extra taps and those three extra taps give you almost about twice the amount of, what is it, brawlers, squad mates, minions, I think they're called minions in this game, but you get almost a twice the amount of minions from every single chest. So in the long run, that is so many more minions that you're gaining from all of the chests. And not only that, you actually can upgrade your chest from a common to a rare and then a rare to an epic so that's so useful because like i said you gain so many more minions in the long run compared to let's say let's go to the shop here in the shop you will spend more coins buying these minions than you would ever do keeping your win streak alive unless of course you like lose every couple of rounds then maybe it's not worth it to use those 5,000 coins but i am posting a video here soon of how i've kept a 50 plus win streak in my game and so i have lots of tips that could help you maintain that win streak so if you're interested in that please subscribe please like this video and that will be out that will be out in a couple of days i'm really excited for it it's been this game has been so fun reason number two so another amazing way to use your coins is to be buying chest tickets that could be here in the shop or that could be just right after the match if you don't have any chests left to open you can just buy chest tickets there and then gain three more chests that is so good because you will gain so many more minions than you ever will from buying minions here in the shop if i opened up three chest fulls of hog riders for only six thousand coins so we'll look here six thousand coins and let's say three of those chests were all hog riders I will gain many more than the actual eight hog riders that are here in the shop. And the hog riders in the shop are 8,000. I would probably, my guess, my estimate would be I would get around 12, around 12 from opening three chests of hog riders. That's for 6,000 coins instead of eight hog riders for 8,000 coins. So again, you wanna buy chest tickets. Chest tickets are cheaper and they give you more minions in the long run than actually using the shop. That is definitely the better bang for your buck for those coins. One final really good way to use your coins in Squad Busters is like, let's say you're dying to spend coins in the shop and you have a ton of coins sitting there like I do. I have 200,000. What I would suggest doing is putting them towards minions that are so close to evolving and what i love about this is in the shop it actually is showing me that mavis if i were to pay to gain those eight mavis cards what is it cards whatever then she will evolve into a higher form that's so good because that will permanently make Mavis better from here on out. It gives her a bonus for whenever I use her, which she basically just gets more loot whenever she picks out carrots from the ground. So let's buy Mavis. Let's buy these Mavis cards? Coins? What? I don't know. And so we get her. And so we just have some cute little baby Mavises. Look at her. So sweet. Yeah, she picks carrots for loot. That's what she does. Well, now, if we go to Mavis... An evolver she's going to evolve into a classic Mavis and the new ability is that she gets bonus loot for fully picking a carrot patch so she just permanently becomes better so there we go we evolve her and just like that that would be definitely the better way to use your coins is to just make sure that you're helping or you're working towards your minions becoming evolved at the fastest rate on uh, just a side note, I would never use my coins to buy any keys. These keys are kind of just like a pay to win. They just help you mid match. They don't really do anything other than just helping you in the match, which in the long run is not going to be giving you that many more minions. You can still win consistently without having to use those keys. I've, ne I've never used a single key other than the tutorial, what the tutorial gave me, and I've been able to keep that 50 win streak. So again, we'll be coming out with more content here soon. Um, so please like and subscribe if you guys enjoyed this. I hope this helped in any way, in some way. <laughs> you guys are awesome. I appreciate all of you um, watching and being here. 
And please be on the lookout for the next couple days. We will see you guys here soon.